everyone, Sherlock Phantom One here, and welcome back. Today I am very excited. Today we are checking out another first time movie watching reaction. It is going to be to the 1999, I don't know if it's a classic, but everybody I feel like has seen it, The Iron Giant. I have never seen this movie. I think maybe actually, maybe I've seen it one time, and I don't even think I saw it all the way through. I just, I, I have a vague memory of babysitting at one point and seeing this movie playing in the background, but I don't know anything about it. Going into this totally blind, I'm very excited though, so let's sit back, grab a snack, and enjoy the reaction. This is The Iron Giant. Ooh, that's a big thing of water. Oh, okay, I thought he saw a big wall of water. Oh, no. That's not a lighthouse. <gasps> Ooh, that's not a lighthouse. And this man is gonna die, and that's the last thing he's seeing. That's a dead man. That's a dead man, for sure. This man is gonna die. Oh my gosh, and the robot doesn't even save him? What the hell? You're just gonna let him die? Oh no, he washed up. Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, and the fall colors. This take place during fall. Oh, little 60s diner. Hogarth, we've been through this before. Hogarth. No pets. Oh, but he's not a pet, Mom. It's a friend. Hogarth, we've got to rent a room this Oh my gosh, what is that? A chipmunk? Mom wants to live in a place with shredded You'll never know he's there. I'll keep him in a cage. Until you feel sorry for him and set him free. I bet he got out. Oh, in the restaurant, too. It better not be a rat. They're gonna have this freaking health okay. department on their ass. Is it a chipmunk or a rat? It had hands. Oh, it's a squirrel! Excuse me. Please don't look, sir. My pet's under your table. Don't look. If you make a scene, my mom won't let me keep him. What Aww. kind of pet, kid? A squirrel. But don't worry, he's friendly. Tell the truth, Daya. It came from outer space. I saw it. Sputnik. Or a flying saucer from Mars. Oh, he's gonna go up his pants, oh boy. I didn't really say anything. If we don't stick up for the kooks, who will? Is my son bothering you, sir? Yes. <laughs> no! Call me Dean! That's a squirrel. Oh, Hogarth, you were going to get your pet, honey? I will, Mom. Right after I finish talking with Dean. Dean. Hey, but... Thank you. I need to work late tonight. There's some cold chicken in the icebox. You can have that and some carrots. <laughs> He's not gonna have any of that. Okay. I love you, honey. Me too. Uh, and Hogarth? No scary movies, no late snacks, in bed by 8 o'clock. Uh huh. Come on, Mom. It's me, remember? Yeah, he's Why he's got it. Can communicate telepathically. Oh my gosh. If we can transplant at least Ew, a Twinkie with into ours, with whipped cream inside of it. Isn't that there already cream inside of it? Who's there? Really? You're going to imitate? Why are you going up when you hear scary noises? Oh, because he missed the movie. He's coming back. Okay. Oh. Wow. Didn't your mom say bed by 8 o'clock and it's you're going out at like 1 in the morning? By yourself in the woods? Really doesn't seem like a good idea. Oh! Something damaged everything. Where did this come from? Ooh, 
Ooh. There's this. Oh. Hello? Better get out of there. You're gonna get smushed. Why is he doing this? Those are electric. Ooh. Oh no! Oh, he's stuck though! You're gonna leave him stuck in there? I don't know what I would do though. I don't know that you can help in this situation. You could- yeah, I was gonna say turn off the power. Why did you do that? Oh, he's waking up. Well, I don't know what you expected. Oh my gosh. You're gonna run over this kid. You're gonna run over this kid. Oh, that's his mom. Okay, thank goodness. Kind of. Why does this guy look like Lefty McGinney from uh, Everyone's Hero? Let's put it this way. Every once in a while, things happen that just can't be rationalized in a conventional way. People want to know that their government has a response. I am that response. So, what do you do again for the government? You just work for the government? Like, there's a lot of pieces to that. Oh, they're gonna have evidence! Oh my gosh, whoa! Yes, that means something big's happening here, eh, or Mr. Manley? Something big, Mark. Something big. What is he doing? Is he bringing the monster a piece of metal? Oh my gosh, and then he's gonna snap a photo, like Bigfoot. Wow, he's really tall. Why do you come looking for him if you're gonna run away? Why did you look for him if you were gonna run away? Oh my gosh, he's fast. He's like Michael Myers fast. I guess he takes bigger steps than he does. Oh, he's got a bloody nose. Dang, he really hit himself. Big mouse trap? What is that? Oh, he's doing it because he saved him. Well, yeah, he was there. So, where are you from? Space. Up there. Oh. Good. oh my gosh, that's a big rock. Yes. Yeah. Tree. No, 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 that's a tree. That is a tree. Rock. Tree. Get it? Oh, he's saying it. That's so nice. This is no meteor, gentlemen. This is something much more serious. So, so we can't call Ripley's believe it or not because they wouldn't believe it. He's falling asleep. He's just rambling. And if I don't get home soon, Mom's gonna. What about him? What is he gonna do? Looking for me and sees you, then we got the screaming problem again. So for now, would you, would you, you know, just, just stay here, okay? I'll come back tomorrow. Oh, he doesn't want you to go. Whoa. Wow. What is... Hello. Goodbye. Gosh. It's like a dog. How far into the woods did he go? He's still coming. Look, you can't go 
stomping around and you can't come with me. My mom will work out. Yes. Right. Yes. So you have got to stay in the forest and I'll bring you some food tomorrow. But I... Oh, watch out. Don't walk on the train track without looking. Oh, he's fascinated by the train. What are you doing? Wait a minute. What do you think you're doing? Look at this mess. Just connect them like okay, that. Oh, good. Good. Now the other. God, she's so cute whenever he does anything. You just say, move. Get out of there now. No, come on, get out. Get out of here. They're gonna... Oh my gosh, move! Move! He just, he abandoned him. He just abandoned that robot. He was like, well, it's, it's all for all, I guess. Anyone report seeing a train accident? What do you mean he hit a giant creature? Oh my gosh, dude. I need your car. I saw him. I need your car. Are you kidding me? You don't just take someone's car. Where are you gonna hide him? In the barn? Okay. Well, I guess if it works. He's still kind of whacking out. And he needs his jaw fixed. Okay. Does anyone know where I can get to a telephone nearby? Um, do you, you're just gonna go to somebody's house? Oh my gosh! What is he doing? Oh my gosh, you are so bad at this. Don't put your hand in there. Don't. Oh my gosh, you're ab living now? He sounds crazy. Get out of here, Satan. Oh that was the best scene. Get out of here, Satan. Oh my gosh, hello, sir. Can you not come right now? Get out of here. Here, let her deal with him. You get the other thing out. Kent Mansley, work for the government. Your parents home? We're eating. None of your business. Oh, hello there. Do you have a telephone I could use? Yes, there's one in the kitchen. Well, thank you. Thank you very much. You don't just let strangers in. You're a gangster, dude. Oh my god. Will you call me at home for this? I don't understand, sir. It, it, it ate my car. And you saw this happen. I didn't actually see it. I went off into the woods. So you don't have any evidence. But, but, sir, I, That's I, the thing. I, He's I not going to have any evidence, though. So. This man is just sitting watching westerns. It, it, it the power station. It, is this the lead of the government? Tell me again, Mansley. Mrs. Hughes, Annie Hughes, and this is my son, Hogarth. Thank you, Annie. Hogarth. That Hogarth. Hogarth. Hogarth? What an embarrassing name. Might as well call him He's Zach. gonna remember. What kind of a sick person would name a kid Hogarth? Yeah, Hogarth. he's gonna. Hogarth Hughes! Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Kent Mansley, you work for the government. I wasn't gonna say that. I have something for you, Hogarth. Your BB gun. Where did you find that? Up at the power station. Hogarth was out there the other night. Really? Oh, good job so dropping that bomb, Mom. Hogarth? Thanks. No. Thing. Unusual. Really? But, okay. I guess just lift up the bar and that's fine. <laughs> that's cool. Thank you again, Annie. Good night, Hogarth. 
Oh shoot, they got a room for rent. That's not good either. What is that gonna mean? I feel like that's gonna come into play later. Oh, he's gonna read him a bedtime story. He's not the hero. He's the villain. He's not like you. You're a good guy. Aww. Like Superman. Oh. Yes, like Superman. You're hungry, aren't you? Oh, give him something. I don't know what you can give him. No, don't take him out again. Just go find something. There yet. People just aren't ready for you. Oh, he wants to see the world. Oh, he's towing it. Oh, scrap place. You guys can get food there. You could have a buffet there. Oh, his car. Our troubles are over. Are you hungry? We can go get some food. <laughs> He's in paradise. What is he gonna start with first? Okay. Go for the bed frame. Oh my gosh. Go for the car. What else? Another car. Eat it quick! Oh my gosh. Just eat it! He just, he just chucked it. Oh shit! No, 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 no! It's, it's fine. It's fine. Oh no! Now he knows about it. Well, he might hurt you though. His name is D. We like Dean. We like Dean. Dean's good. <laughs> oh, oh my gosh. Where'd, uh, where'd he come from? Space. Remember. He's like a little kid. He changing he his attitude so quickly. Yeah. Well, my friend. There's some Frankenbot. Out of state plays over here making me change my attitude. I thought he was cool a minute ago. Why is it's, he just not freaked out anymore? Tell me he doesn't have school today. That would that would suck. No. No, thank you. Morning, sport. Oh come on! I knew it. Is he staying here? Yep, I told you that was coming back into play, and that he was gonna rent it because he's suspicious. <laughs> Gosh, hey, can you stop eavesdropping on me? Buckaroo? Now, why would you tell your mom about a giant robot? Try what you see at the power station. I talked to you, tell anyone else. Dude, get out of here! The sky. Yeah, first satellite in space. Foreign satellite, hold on. All that that implies. Even now. Orbits overhead. Boop. Boop. Watching us. We can't see it, but it's Why did she suggest that her like ten year old son hang out with this middle aged man? I don't feel safe, Hogar. Do you? Stressing this ten year old out. This middle man is fun, but who built it? The Russians, the Chinese, Martians, Canadians? I don't care. All I know is we didn't build it, and that's reason enough to assume the worst and blow up the kingdom come. Now. You are going to tell me about this thing. You are going to lead me to it, and we are going to destroy it before it destroys us. He's going to tell his mom, and you're going to not be in their house anymore. Cool. Welcome to downtown Coolsville. My gosh, this kid. Well, can you move Coolsville to someplace less conspicuous? How about the lake? Okay. Oh, come with us. It'll be fun. Oh. Come on. Alright, we're watching, we're watching. 
Oh, come on, jump in. It's too shallow, but you can do it. Here it comes! Here it comes! Woo! That lake is not deep enough. There is no way that lake was deep enough for him to submerge like that. Okay, it wasn't. He splashed all the water out. Okay. It's even weirder. I think I'm feeling better now. Much, much better. Oh, oh boy. Oh, what a scene. Beautiful. Hey, look. Oh, don't scare the deer. So let's look at it. Don't scare it. Oh, what a graceful creature. Hmm. Well, I guess he decided to. What the hell? Dude, you you just keep exposing yourself, and they shot the deer, and they shot him. Oh no! He's gonna be depressed all the time now. I was gonna say you didn't do anything. It's part of life. It's bad to kill, but it's not bad to die. Oh my gosh! I don't need this existential crisis right now. Someday. Probably not. We got this weirdo again. Your mom's working late tonight, Hogarth. So it's just us guys, and we're gonna have a little chat. Okay. Why would the mom leave her child with this man who she knows nothing about? Just because he says he works for the government doesn't mean that he's a good person. Like, you just, uh, just oh my gosh. He has the right to remain silent. Does this ring a bell? No. No? How about this? I don't know who that is. That's his twin brother. He doesn't know. It doesn't prove anything. It's enough to get the army here with one phone call. Then what's stopping you? Where's the giant? No. You can't protect him, Hogarth. Any more than you can protect your mother. No. What does that mean? Uh, it's difficult to raise a boy all along. We can make it more difficult. In fact, we can make it so difficult that it would be irresponsible for us to leave you in her care. Why? Supplies. You'll be taken away from her, Hogarth. You can't do that. Why would you do that? She has no. You have no proof that she's a bad parent. He's in the junkyard. No, Hogarth. <laughs> junkyard, of course. Get out of his room. Call the police. Tell this guy that you're ho being held hostage in your own home. Oh my gosh, he's really gonna stare him out. He's gonna sleep in his shoes? Okay. He's gonna fall asleep eventually. Where is his mom? I, I know she was working late, but is she really not home yet? Yard, Mr. Mansley. Please call me Kent. Yeah. 
What's happening? Why is he so friendly? Okay. Sir, listen, step outside, Mansley. Yes. Oh, he's using him as an art piece. You just blew millions of Uncle Sam's dollars out of your butt. I gotta admit, I'm relieved that this is what Hogarth was talking about. I mean, I was beginning to uh, <laughs> think it was real. <laughs> no, it is real, I mean, but don't we wrong. don't have I to like discuss it. that right in but, front of him. Uh, do you need all this stuff on the surface? Oh my gosh. Don't blink. Don't blink. Please don't blink. Okay. Good. They did it. Kind of. I can't. It's all that implies. Okay. You can move now. Oh my gosh. He was so good staying still. Thrust her to base. I'm going in. Only one creature could create so much destruction. The hidden, people eating, killing machine, Otomo! Oh, he's just twiddling his thumbs. No, Otomo. <gasps> he didn't even see it. Oh my gosh, it sets him off. Stay down and follow me. No, he's not gone bad. He's not gone bad. It's not like that. No, it's not like that. No, Dean, you can't turn on him now. No, stop. It was an accident. He's our friend. No. Hardware, Hogarth. Why do you think the army was here? He's no, a come on. A big gun that, that walks. No. Uh, I, I got a gun. Yeah? What's that, huh? You almost did that to Hogarth. Right now. No. This poor baby. He's not Superman anymore. I told you it was a big hoax. <laughs> No, oh gosh, are they gonna- Robot's gonna save them, but nobody's gonna be happy about it. Hello. He saved them, so don't- please don't shoot him. Good. I am not a gun. No. What the hell? No, 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 no! Listen, you gotta make them stop. The giant's got the kid with him. I'll take care of it. No, you won't. I know you won't. Where are you going, Dean? Says the monster's killed a kid. Sir, we must stop it. That's Dude, what? That is not what it. Repeat, code red. Oh my gosh. Mr. President, we have a situation, sir. Yeah, the mom's gonna get into action. Dean, where did you go? Wait. Like Superman. Superman fly. Oh no! Oh shoot! They're airborne child and this robot. Oh, jeez! Ooh! Wow! That was quite a trip. Good call, Mansley. <laughs> No, come on. No, he's not dead. And the robot's gonna blame himself. Don't you do this right now! It's still alive! 
There's a kid! No! No, now he's gonna go really pissed. No! No, 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 no! There's no way you're getting a clean shot from all the way over there. Not everything, General. The bomb. What bomb? The Nautilus has first strike capability and is not far offshore. You scared me, Mansley. I was gonna you say this. To bomb ourselves in order to kill it? General, the giant seems to follow whatever attacks it. We can lure it away from the town, then destroy it. Oh my gosh. Everyone, out of the car. We have to no. What are you talking about? We gotta get this boy to a hospital. What boy? Hogarth! Oh shoot, he's going after him. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, well that kind of worked out. Oh no, it didn't. No, it didn't. What is that? You are what you choose to be. Oh no. Come on. He was full on ready too. It's okay, it's okay. We gotta show them you're good. You're good. Not unless to Rogar. Missile armed and ready. What are you saying? He's friendly? Yes. Attacking him is triggering a defense mechanism. Don't listen, General. Destroy the monster. Well, we still have the chance. Oh my gosh. General, you shoot now and the whole thing starts all over again. But now, General, our future's at stake. Order, sir. Which is why you have got to stop. General. Just stop for a second. Just stop. Oh my gosh. This dude needs to get arrested. He needs to go to prison. Oh. This missile is targeted to the giant's current position. Where's the giant, Mansley? Right in front of us. You didn't put the Come together. On. There's a fallout shelter right There's there. There's no way to survive this, you idiot. You mean we're all going to two deaths? Yeah, because of you. For our country. Screw our country. I want to live. What? You were not a pansy to call it on everybody else, but now that you're gonna All get it too, you're gonna leave? Stays here like a good soldier. Oh my gosh. Well, everybody say their last goodbyes. Giant? They still never gave him a name. <laughs> no following. Ooh, here it comes. You are who you choose to be. Superman. So he's gone, gone. No, he's not. Is that him or no? Okay. Oh, that's so cute. The guy who saved the town. Your best work yet, honey. No doubt about it. Oh my gosh, are they in a relationship? Really? Well, you, you know, next to that bug. Thing. The only part recovered. I thought you should have it. What is it? It's the bolt in his neck? Oh. Is he really gone gone or is he gonna come back? It has to be because it's tracking. 
can grab all his, he can call all his parts back. So where is he? See you later. Wait. What? Okay, so it's just going back to him. He's not back. Okay. Oh, he is alive! Yay! Alright, so that was the Iron Giant. Honestly, that was a lot different than I expected. I, I did not know that Dean was going to be a main character, let alone he was going to be a good character. For some reason, I feel like when I saw the trailers for this when I was a kid, I always thought he was going to be like the bad character, but I, I don't know. It was very surprising. I, I do have to admit, now that I realize, now that I realize, I actually feel like I have seen the ending to this, so I wasn't that surprised when he'd said, you stay, I go, because I feel like I've seen that part in like clips and snippets as like a reference of some of the saddest movie deaths. But um, I didn't know that he actually comes back or that he doesn't come back, but he actually is alive. And honestly, I was really surprised with the story, how much I was able to engage with it because I wasn't sure I was gonna totally love this in the first half. And then I was like, I kind of enjoy this. I kind of like the simpler scenes more than the action packed scenes. I'm just kind of made that way, I guess. But I really enjoyed the first half and the second half. I really felt like the last half was a little rushed and maybe a little bit too action-packed, but also a little bit too quickly solved. Like, the fact that Hogarth basically didn't say, like, oh no, don't go, or, you know, stay. And I'm not saying that he should have done that, because obviously it's good that he let the robot go, but, like, he didn't... He didn't even hesitate to let him go. He was like... I know you gotta go, and he's gotta sacrifice himself. And we never saw the arrest of the freaking Keith guy, so, or Kent guy, so I'm really annoyed with that. Like, why did we not get justice for that? We didn't see him get arrested or put in cuffs or anything, so what happened with that guy? Um, basically was going to let the whole town die, and he was like, I don't want to die, so I'm out of here. And it was like, okay, you're willing to play the game, but not pay the toll, okay. But anyway, I had a really fun time with this. Um, I'm glad that I finally sat down and watched it. I don't know that it's in my top five or even ten favorite movies, but I'm really glad that I checked it out and I liked it for what it was. So, this one was cute, but I don't think I'll watch it again. But I'm glad that I sat down and watched it at least one time. So if you guys did enjoy, be sure to leave a like on the video. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for staying awesome. And until next time, guys, bye! Never break, always fight, never quit. Do it right, play the game, win it life.